Hello, Sci-Fi Network. Yeah, this is your vice president of programming. <laughs> you know, we have made a horrible mistake regarding alphas. Yeah, we need to uncancel it immediately. Well, you just put me through to the people who handle that. You tell them it's me. And I don't want to answer a lot of questions about if I really am who I say I am. You know? I just, I want this done. Yeah, no, I am not the person who just called. <laughs> and that man was clearly a cowboy. Yeah, who was plum concerned about y'all canceling his favorite show. <laughs> Why do they keep hanging up on me? Sorry you're upset. You know, Sheldon, sometimes people seek the comfort of physical contact in moments like this. <laughs> I am not flying back to Texas just so my mom can give me a hug. <laughs> okay, well, what I think is going on here is you have a pathological need for closure. Oh, that's nonsense. I mean, you tell me stories about your day all the time. I don't care how they end. You know, I might be able to help you with this. There's a whole field of behavioral neuroscience that examines ways to retrain your neural pathways so stuff like this bothers you less. Yeah, but I just told you, I don't have a problem with closure. You sure about that? Oh, uh, quite sure. That proves nothing. I've come up with a series of exercises to help with your compulsive need for closure. What? I take issue with the word compulsive. <laughs> All I'm saying is we live in a world where closure isn't always an op... <laughs> Shun, okay. And for the sake of argument, let's say I have a problem. What would be your plan for addressing it? I'm going to recondition your brain so that the need for completion isn't so overwhelming. <laughs> By playing tic-tac-toe? Yep, your turn. Oh, Amy. And you wonder why people think neuroscience is nothing but a goofy game for diaper babies. <laughs> tic-tac-toe can only end in win, lose, or draw none of which will deny me closure. Yeah. Especially since I'm about to win. <laughs> well, we didn't finish. Exactly. How does that make you feel? The same way any normal person would. I like I want to peel off my own face and tear it in two and then again and again till I have a handful of Sheldon face confetti. For the land of the free and the home of the... Next. <laughs> That's quite an impressive layout, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Let's box it up. Let's box it up. That's enough. <laughs> Sheldon, give it! <laughs> Amy, I must say, I was skeptical at first, but this has truly been a transformative evening. I'm a little surprised to hear you feeling so positive. Well, you're an excellent neuroscientist. You're a wonderful girlfriend. And... And? Doesn't matter, does it? I'm proud of you, Sheldon. And a complete sucker. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> and the home of the brave. <laughs> Don't stop. Yes, keep going. Just like that. Almost there. Almost there. Uh -huh. <laughs>